Known as the Windy City, Chicago is a fantastic place to explore. This is Katie from Creative Travel Guide and today we share the things to know before you go to Chicago. Looking for more travel tips? Make sure to hit subscribe and ring that notification bell. So firstly, we have the best time to visit. The spring and autumn months are the best times to visit Chicago. This is when the weather is cool and hotel room rates are lower than in the summer. Christmas in Chicago can be magical but cold. Bring plenty of layers to keep warm. There are many festivals and events which run through the summer months, so this is also a great time if you are heading for the festivals. So now let's look at getting there. Most people choose to fly into Chicago, arriving either at the O'Hare International Airport or Chicago Midway Airport. From both airports, you can catch a train to downtown Chicago. Alternatively, you can catch an Amtrak train to Chicago as well, with routes available from Milwaukee, St. Louis, and Detroit, whilst megabuses offer bus routes for many Midwest cities. So now let's look at getting around. Chicago is a walkable city, but there are also plenty of transportation options too. Firstly, you could use the bike sharing program to get around the city or take the water taxi. Both are perfect for the summer months. The CTA operates an elevated train system that can get you to most neighborhoods and sites in the city, whilst the buses can help you get further afield. So now let's look at typical prices. Dorm beds in Chicago begin at $50, whilst budget hotel rooms begin at $100. Mid-range rooms in good locations start at around $120 when you book in advance, whilst four-star hotels begin at around $170, and five-star hotels tend to begin around $300 a night. Simple breakfasts can be found for under $5, whilst cheap eats are under $10, and they can be found all over the city, especially away from the tourist sites. For a sit-down dinner, expect to pay at least $20 in less touristy areas, whilst prices can reach up to $80 or $100 per person, depending on the location and the restaurant. So Chicago can be explored on any budget, especially when you know how to save money. Firstly, take advantage of the free attractions like the Lincoln Park Zoo and the Millennium Park. Then get yourself a city pass to save money on the paid attractions. We will leave the link in the description below. Take a free walking tour and check out the free festivals which occur throughout the year. You can also enjoy the free seasonal events like the St. Patrick's Day parades and the Magnificent Mile Lights Festival. Visit in the off season to save money on accommodation and flights, then stick to the public transport to get around Chicago. There are plenty of things to see and do in Chicago to keep you busy. Firstly, see the city from above at the Sky Deck at Willis Tower, formerly known as Sears Tower, before heading to one of the many museums, such as the Chicago History Museum, the Art Institute of Chicago, or the Museum of Science and Industry. Stroll through Grant Park and Millennium Park, then head over to Navy Pier in the evening. Feast off deep dish pizza and Chicago hot dogs, then take a walk along the River Walk or visit the Lincoln Park Zoo. Finally, make sure to watch the Chicago Cubs play at Wrigley Field if you are visiting during the baseball season. Watch this video to find out the 10 best things to do in Chicago. Then, to learn how to visit Chicago on a budget, watch this video. We hope you have a fantastic time and stay creative.